Hey guys, uh, Carl here from uh, Wide Universe Studios, and uh, you might know me on the forum as Carl Blanchet. And in this video, uh, I'll be showing you how to save your high scores to a table in Game Salad. Now, this is pretty simple, so uh, let's get going. Firstly, we're going to start by making a high score table, which will have as many rows as levels as you will have. And um, since we'll be recording the score, which is an integer attribute, we'll um, use an integer right here. After that, we'll be making two integer attributes, one for the score and uh, one for the level number. Now, this level number will determine in which level you will be. So in here, those will be my uh, level select buttons, and uh, it displays the text of level one. When touch is press, pressed, it will change the scene to level one and level number to one. Now, level two will have the same uh, action, but to scene two and to level number two. And of course, it will display level two. After that, if we go into level one, up here I have the score, which displays the score attribute. And up here I have the high score, and this is where the magic happens. So firstly, I tell it to display the table cell value, which I go get from the high score table. And now here's the trick. As the level, um, or the row, I use the level number. So remember how I said when you'll be in level one, it'll be level number uh, as one. And then when you're in level two, the game level number attribute will be two and etc. So that will be getting the row according to the level. And of course, it'll be in column one. After that, I tell it uh, uh, in a timer, I say every zero seconds, run a completion. If attribute score is greater than table cell value, game dot high score table, game level number, and column one, change uh, that table cell value to the score. And then I tell it to save the, the table. In here, down there, I have uh, the next button, which pretty much uh, tells it to go to the next uh, scene and it changes level number to level number plus one. Now these things, when they're touched, as I will show you, they add plus one to the score. So we'll start by going level one, and we'll touch uh, three of these. And I'll jot that down so we can remember, three. And then level two, let's go with two. And the next, uh, we'll go with a five here. Five for level three. And level four, we'll go with one. Level five, we'll go with three. And uh, level six, we'll go with uh, four. Okay, so now I'm uh, at the end here. And uh, tells me all my high scores here. Level one is three. Level two is two. Level three is five. And then level four is one. Level five is three. And level six is four. If I go back in the main menu and return in those levels, you will clearly see that this uh, table cell value is uh, getting the high score that was previously entered. And there you go. Now I'll be attaching this demo to uh, this video. It'll be in the description down below. You can download it and do whatever you'd like with it. As well as if you like this video, make sure to leave it a thumbs up and subscribe. Tell me what you think about it. And that way I know if uh, you guys want me to make more. So um, uh, thanks for watching and uh, best of luck with your projects. <laughs> Later.